Do you, are you feeling? Are you feeling enthusiastic? I'm gonna just, you know, <laughs> right past that one. Um, are you getting the feeling that there's not as much enthusiasm about the Broncos as they start to come back into town and get ready for their first workouts? Are you, are you getting the impression there's not as much as there has been in past years, or is it too early? Uh, well, I'm, I'm thinking that out. Yeah, that's a very interesting question and an interesting observation that you had during the, the commentary. Uh, I think it's just a pause in the storm. You know how when a tornado sure. comes and there's that quiet while you're in the middle of You've probably never been in the middle of a tornado. I have. Well, I've been around tornadoes. Yeah. And I think it's just the, the lull. Uh, and, and we've had two of the Broncos players who potentially will be starters this year. Uh, and I thought... Uh, T.J. Ward was great last year about, last yesterday about, you know, I don't want to be a linebacker anymore <laughs> that he had to, you know, really move into the linebacker spot last year. Uh, but he talked about, he hadn't gotten over it. He hadn't gotten over last year. I think some people are still, uh, hangover is not the right word, but I think people are still having a hangover about what happened, another upset in the first round at home when people thought, and, and I pulled out, uh, I'm, I'm going to visit some friends soon. I pulled out the book that Mike Kliss and I wrote about the Broncos, and I was reading the last part of it, and I said, it's not over. You know, they're, they're going to come back stronger. This was written after the Super Bowl. And I went, it didn't quite work out like we all thought it would last year that they would be contenders to win the Super Bowl. And the air went out of the bag in a big hurry. So I think there's still some letdown among the players, among the uh, – among the fans, among the media, that people aren't as... I think there's going to be more of a cautious approach this year to the Broncos, that when they set the record two years ago, everybody was so amped about what was going on. Last year, <clears throat> they were amped again. You had to get over the letdown of what happened in the Super Bowl. Amped again. It all leads, though, oh, you and I were sitting here. We had started the program. We were talking about number one seeding. Number two seeding, got to have the home field advantage. Oh, gee, the Colts are coming in. This is a great opportunity for Peyton to get even with the Colts and Ursay and all the stuff, and then they lose. I mean, it's been a gasp since then. You know, people are just, huh. I, I, I want to take it even a step further. You use the term amped up. I use the term happed up. However you want to describe it, think about this, Wood. This will be a good Sunday column for you, okay? All right. You're welcome. Well, can I at least determine? The end of this goes. This goes all the way back to 2008. Let, let me paint that picture for you. 2008, they fire Shanahan. They hire Josh McDaniels, which was a storm unto itself. He gets rid of Cutler. He gets rid of Brandon Marshall. They get rid of him They're, because of because of another Spygate episode. Um, they bring in. He's going to mention him. I he am, is going I to am, mention him. Get ready for it. Wait for it. So they bring in John Fox. <laughs> or, sorry, I skipped the part. Sorry. Oh, yeah, Tim Tebow. Tim Tebow comes in and all the crap and circus that went on around Tebow. Then they fire the McDaniels. Good stuff, too. Then, then they fire McDaniels. Um, then they bring in John Fox. And then they bring in Peyton Manning. And, I, and and then it's Super Bowl. I mean, it really hasn't it hasn't stopped. We've been very much the center of the NFL universe for about seven years running now. So I'm wondering if people are getting a little a little weary of it, or okay. does it all just get no. amped up again no, once the season no, it's starts? Sports. Okay, I would totally. I kind of liked it. <laughs> That's the column I'm supposed to write. That's the column yeah. you're supposed to write. You write Don't that forget column. the Tebow part. Well. 